block against this one, right? Um, some people were going to the head here. Some people were feel more comfortable out here. Kind of active posting. Whatever you feel, kind of experiment with this. I feel like my balance is better here. Some people feel like they get better pressure here. But the key is, if we use this one here, as a block, and then I come inside. Right here. So it's a really subtle movement. So when someone's not giving you this inside space, you can't grind it in. I have this thread here. Walk to the side, kick this to the ground. You can wait here and here. And I use this one, pin, come inside. And here I am right back in that inside position. Make sure you keep your inside position. You can fully expect it to try to be getting this back in again. So make sure when you get this in, you maintain it. So when this tries to come back in, I have this connection here. So one more time. Tony has this good grip here. I can't get this inside position. So I come out, I block. And of course, if you can bring it over, just bring it over. That'll sometimes happen. More commonly, I use this foot. Block. Okay? Let's give it a try. One thing I want to try. I might have to start the one, two, three. <laughs> it's now expected. One, two. Three. One, Shinobi. <laughs> All right, Shinobi vlog. I haven't done a vlog for a while since my last confession. So Jeffrey Knight is going to do the technique that we did today. Hey, guys. Not cooking your training partner. <laughs> Very good. Back and forth, back and forth. Keep weight there. Catch. Pummel. Now my hands, if my hands are here, I'm in trouble. So I need to come forward enough that I'm out of trouble. And I need to get enough weight on my hands that my legs become light. I'm going to pummel this in. If you don't get it the first try, just try a few times. So you get that shin on shin contact right there. Hey guys, welcome to Shinobi. I'm just gonna show a quick sequence that we did today. Um, this is a sequence I learned from Oliver Taza at a seminar at my friend Sven's gym in Cologne, Germany. Game Theory Jiu Jitsu, check it out. He's got a new gym opening soon. Um, and this is a nice pummeling sequence to get one foot in, one foot out, when your partner has sticky hooks on the inside. So check it out, guys. Our standard entry to, to one foot in, one out is a shin grinding entry. So we go one in, one out. You get shin on shin, you grind it in like this with this basic windshield wiper. This sets us, sets us up for a lot of good leg attacks. Good knee cut passes, right? We've got a couple of variations of this. When people get their foot really sticky and can't get this turned in, grind the knee all the way down to the mat and then come right back up. Here we have the leg. We can do all sorts of nice entries here. But people are getting really good at defending this. Their hooks are getting sticky. They're grabbing onto my feet and this is getting to be really problematic. All he has to do is put one leg through and it's straight into leg locks. So what Oliver Tazza showed was a really nice entry where I walk down and I pin here. I can use my hand, come out to the mat, and then I use this foot as a block. So flip the foot, pull them back in, and now I'm in that one foot, one foot in, one foot out position. So again, the partner has really sticky hooks, I can't break it, I can't get this inside position, and he's about to take me down. I walk over to the side, and I pin with my knee and my hand. If you're more comfortable, you can also put your hand out to the mat. And then the magic is I use this foot here as a block. Windshield wiper in, and now I'm in this nice one, one, one foot in, one foot out position. From here I can come with hands forward, sort of an active posting style pass, windshield wiper foot in, and there's all sorts of good things that can happen here. I can extend, drive right to mount, or I can start to pass with weight on the hips. So one more time, from here, I come down to the mat, I pin, post, pummel, now I have this one foot in, one foot out position. Make sure my head is past the line of his head, pummel shin to shin, and I'm very, very comfortable here. I can extend, drop straight down, or I can start to pummel and go straight there. So that's what we worked on today here at Shinobi. Thanks. Doing a few okay. more vlogs. And today is obviously Jiu Jitsu. So, till next one. Hashtag Rafter. Rafter.